it's nice to know there were no apparent adverse effects at even 27 cups of broccoli a day's worth of these cruciferous phytonutrients. But there has to be some point at which it becomes toxic, and indeed there is. Some researchers in Italy tried to push the envelope. They're trying to come up with an IV infusion dose to use as actual chemotherapy, and so wanted to know how high they could go. And yes, there was a level at which you can cause DNA damage at the equivalent of about 100 cups of broccoli a day, or actually just four cups of broccoli sprouts. They conclude no sign of DNA lesions could be observed at nutritionally attainable concentrations. But that's not really true. I mean, you could eat four cups of the sprouts a day. See, they don't know health nuts like I know some health nuts. Uh, someone uh, came up to me after a lecture a few years ago uh, down in Florida and said how he heard that you know, wheatgrass juice was so good for you, cleans you out, and so he wanted to try stuffing himself with it. So he told me he calculated the volume of the human digestive tract, all 10 yards or so, and proceeded to drink that amount continuously, quart after quart, until it started coming out the other end. So I asked him, well, what happened? And he looked up at me with an expression I can only describe as rapture, and no joke, said, it was volcanic.